So a lot of famous actors, they really care about important issues and they turn activist. Remember Jane Fonda? She mistook her experience acting out a journalist in a thriller about something that happened in a fictional nuclear power plant for reality. Or consider Mark Ruffalo, the guy who plays the Hulk. Now, for those who don't know, the Hulk is a fictional character. It is the alter ego that erupts from Bruce Banner after Bruce Banner got exposed to gamma rays. The problem is his activism against nuclear energy. Now, we just published a video which has nothing to do with nuclear power per se. In this video, he says that there's a misinformation campaign going on against climate scientists and that this misinformation campaign is being funded by the fossil fuel industry. Now, the trouble is that the other people like Epstein, for instance, they may be paid by the fossil fuel industry. Now, Mark Ruffalo is a useful fool. He doesn't need to be paid to be against something that the fossil fuel industry doesn't like. To prove this, we only have to consider the Indian Point nuclear power station in New York. At the beginning of 2020, there were two units still operational in this nuclear power plant. Now, these reactors created masses of clean power for roughly 44 years. Despite all of that, New York said, nah, we are going to close these, these nuclear power plants. And this is in part due to famous misguided activists like Jane Fonda and Mark Ruffalo and others who keep pushing the false belief that nuclear energy is dangerous and dirty. Now, nuclear is neither of those. Nuclear is the foundational technology which we need to reduce carbon emissions while creating a better future for everyone, which is where Ruffalo and I should be aligned. And that's why I hope that famous people think more before stepping up to their soapbox and trying to crusade against something that they don't really understand. Ah, buckle this! Ludicrous speed! Go!